everyone, welcome to my channel. So today's video is going to be me playing with the Huda Huda um, Rose Gold Remastered. I have played with it before. I have filmed using this palette. Somehow my video either got lost or I didn't press record. Happens. <laughs> so here I am back once again. Um, playing with it and trying to come up with a look using this palette. I am going to use the Lumi um, Huda foundation and oh, where did it go? I am going to use the skin filter fin skin finish faux filter skin finish foundation stick but because I got it so dark I'm going to use this as a bronzer. So let's get started don't mind my hair I let it air dry and this actually I tamed it I seriously tamed it um, but this is what happens when when I air dry um, so don't don't mind it don't mind it um, yeah and it was way bigger it was like seriously about this big um, but I tamed it so trying here um, let's put on a headband and let's get this hair out of my way. Dark concealer, circle concealer. And the reason why I'm trying to use this is because I am trying my hardest to use it up. Um, so I'm just going to take that right there on my lids. That felt so refreshing on my lids. For some reason, my lids are like... Not burning, but irritated. Like, I don't know. So, I'm not sure on what happened with that. But I'm just taking this little sponge and just... Yeah, so I really liked the look that I had did last time. But because I can't find it, having to redo it, maybe I will um, remember how I created that look. Um... I highly doubt it, but, <laughs> but we will see. So, this is what it looks like. It does come with a mirror. It always comes with like a little, sh a little sheet like this. She is so beautiful, you guys. Then that is what it looks like. And it came with already little like little dips in it. I'm not sure on why, but it's all right. Um, so I'm gonna start with let's start with a Luxie a Luxie brush in small tapered blending, and we will go in to we'll go into Demore. Ooh, I almost dug my finger into that. Demore is right there. So I'm very proud of myself, you guys, because I am creating more looks using more um, products and just making it a point to use everything in my um, in my vanity and my drawers and everything so I'm very very happy that I have been using that now I need to get into using my skincare because there I only use out of so many that I do have I use maybe two three I think it's three because my Sunday Riley The Alchemist and there's another one and I don't remember 111 skin and I need to start using a little bit more just to see if it would irritate my skin because I do want to try new um, new skincare I mean I get so much in my subscription subscription boxes and 
I don't use it. I either give it to Yesenia or I um, just have it in my drawer. Some of it is in a giveaway that I do have kind of piling up ready for my 400 subscriber. And then I have a really big one that I'm adding um, a lot of things for my 500 subscriber giveaway. So, and then I have little ones, just tiny little ones. It does build up very, very nicely. Um, that I just have to put the video up. I have to edit it and put it up because I already filmed it. But I have to edit it. So, I don't know what's my deal. I just am procrastinating. This is, I mean, I'm going to use Man Eater. I'm procrastinating for whatever reason and it's very irritating. And I'm taking that on a Luxie eye shading brush in 213. I'm tapping off the excess and just going in. And I'm just patting that in. Most likely I'm going to go in with my, uh, with the black that's in this palette just to kind of give it a little bit more dimension there but yes I already have them filmed I just need to edit and for whatever reason I have not so I need to get on the ball with that I'm just building this up just a little bit and just taking that a little further in than what I normally do and I'm gonna go in with the same brush into the black black truffle you know what let's take that with a different brush let's take that with the Nikita dragon in n1 and we're gonna take black truffle and just on the outer it picked up but it's not applying so I'm just gonna do the outer I'm gonna create a wing so I'm just gonna leave it like that for right now so yeah this is very pretty and the other look I was gonna try to create it but honestly I don't remember it I don't remember how I did it so I'm just creating whatever different one today all right then going in going in with fling right here I'm gonna take that well let's take that on the brush first and let's see how that applies with a brush and then we will go in with my finger because if I remember correctly it did better with my finger so this one is my Nikita N2 picked up very nice I think I'm gonna like it better because it is the cream to powder one I believe or at least it feels like that it's very creamy then taking this pink diamond right here yeah right here and just taking that onto my finger that is very pretty and just applying right okay so I'm going to clean this off and I'm going to come back and apply my foundation okay going in with my going in with my peace water this I've been really really loving like really loving so it's just taking a little goopy stuff that out of my way and I lost my fan I don't know what I did with it. I had like three. I had a battery one. I had two battery ones. And then I had two just hand fans. Mm -mm. Lost them. Don't know what I did. Okay. And then I'm going to. I'm going to. Use this gold bed in bright eyes just a little one and I'm just putting that right
and uh, and this is why I like my hair in a bun. Just keeps on getting in the way. Shaking this up. Okay, shaking this up right here. Just putting a little bit. And this foundation is in Custard, Custard 220N. So, okay. And then I'm going to go in with my, I don't have concealer from Huda, so I'm going to go in with my, I don't know what I did, with, okay, with my Tarte Glow. I don't like the wand on this. I really do like Shape Tape a lot better than the wand on this. I'm going in with my Joa, just right smack in the middle. I got that tart in a uh, box of charms and I really do like it. Gives it a beautiful glow. Only thing I don't like about this foundation is it does not do good on my my nose. <laughs> but a lot of foundations don't, so that stinks. So going in with my Huda in Biscot Biscotti. That's what it looks like. I don't know how I thought that I would be this color, guys. Going in with my going in with my crown brush. And I'm just going to do going back into the palette. We're gonna take my Nikita N9. And we're going to take Risque right here. And we're just going to put that on the lower lash. I'm going in with Man Eater. I'm just giving it a little bit more. Going in with Black Truffle. And just taking that once again, making it a little bit more dark. Going in with Bubbly right here, taking that onto my finger, going into my inner corner, taking this brush right here and going back in to a Bubbly and going into, onto my brow bone. Then going into this, I have been really liking this. And that Winky Lux is really, uh oh, is really good as well. So just starting with brushing up my eyebrows, going in with the darkest shade right there, and starting with the bottom, working my way, and then taking my Natasha Denona, going into the cream blush right there. Just taking that onto my blush brush. This brush right here, going into this highlight right there. Oh, it's actually a, damn it. Going into this highlight there and just taking that right up on top above my lip on my cupid's bow both of these i do love they are so similar but i think i'm gonna go with taking this bella pierre and drawing getting my joy ride taking my tart so 
this is the final look. So if you like my video, give me a thumbs up. If you want to join my little family, hit the subscribe button, ring the notification bell, just to get notified whenever I do upload a new video. All right, guys, see you guys in the next one. Bye.